where he has come from, isn't it? Finally today, his guitar concerto is rated in the top ten classical favourites. He was blind, Spanish, but received an honorary degree from Exeter University. A special centenary concert is to be held tonight in London, celebrating the life of Joaquim Rodrigo. A strong Exeter contingent will be there, including 21 works of art created by one of the city's top artists. <laughs> Well, the reason why it's so unique is the fact that um, there are so many things coming together through this one occasion. Um, for example, the um, actual concert itself is to show the different styles of Rodrigo. And uh, that's why the paintings actually are working in the same way, to actually follow the music, as it were. Well, Raymond Calcroft, whose um, baby this concert is, in fact, he's done the complete arranging, it's his uh, complete idea, um, actually uh, asked me to do these paintings uh, because we've done this before when Cecilia Rodrigo, who is the daughter of, uh, of Joaquin Rodrigo, um, actually approved of my paintings, and so we thought we'd do it again on a much larger scale. Um, I very much like the idea of the warmth of Spain and the type of music and the atmosphere that the, the music gives you and I find that in a way easy to paint. It's, it's something that I like to do. <laughs> 21 paintings actually are based directly onto the music. Um, uh, one of them is the uh, Cantico to Mosanchinto, which is a very special piece. And that triptych is going to be hanging right in the center of the stage. Rodrigo's main connection really with Exeter is the fact that he's a very close friend of Raymond Calcraft. Uh, he's a family friend and uh, Raymond Calcraft is actually the conductor of the Royal Philharmonic for this event as well. Um, and he invited Rodrigo over to actually um, have an honorary degree from the University of Exeter. And I got to know him then. I think it's, a, it's going to be a one-off. The, the sort of slogan is really that Exeter goes to town. And I think that's exactly what we're going to do. It's going to be, as I say, a one-off occasion, and it's going to be a very, very special evening altogether.